board looks nice. Yes. Welcome to Something Cinema. We are watching Stranger Things Season 4, Chapter 3. We currently have 13,241 subscribers at the time of this recording. Our subscriber shoutouts, we have Electric and Shannon Jefferson. Uh, our patron is Film Productions 816. Thank you for being a patron, and you do comment a lot, so we appreciate that. Very much so. <clears throat> on sound, we got Sam Smith, Writings on the Wall. Interesting song choice. Uh, would you rather eat hamburgers in Italy or spaghetti in the U.S.? Hamburgers in Italy. Hamburgers in Italy. I mean, Italy. Would you rather never get a full night's sleep for a week or sleep for 48 hours straight? Sleep for 48 hours straight. Never get a full night's sleep. I hours. still don't get that. Shut up. Uh, would you rather have one free international trip every year or fly domestically everywhere for free? Why do you think of more people to give up reading to? Why do you want to give up TV? I like the way that pen writes. You're welcome. Thank you. Alright, let's get into it. remind you of anything, Doctor? Why are you here? Really? I like your opinion. I was fired, in case you forgot. Something, something is going on in the town that nobody, nobody fully comprehends. And I also understand that military strength is not the answer. So what is the answer, Doctor? Mm -hmm. Everything that has happened in Hawkins could be traced back to Brenner's little pet. Wouldn't you agree? <laughs> trained her for this very thing. Eleven is dead. I'm not convinced. So where has she been? All this time? There are rumors she's alive okay. and seeking help from someone on the inside. Now you can make this easy and tell us where she is. Or oh, we can do this the hard way. Got all sorts of dust in your hair and shit. I want to know everything he's done and everyone he's spoken to in the past year. And if we're lucky, he'll lead us right to the girl. Mom? Well, well! Aren't you out of sight for sore eyes, huh? Hi, Murray. The kids like risotto? So there I was, head down to the I-5, going to see a client out in Ventura. I'm looking for a motel to stay for the night, and suddenly, bam! It hits me. Didn't the buyers move here? You should just stay. I'd be tempted, Joyce, except, you know, you have that, uh... Right, that business trip. Business trip? What business trip? A conference tomorrow in Alaska. Alaska? Brandon, right? <laughs> That's where they're based, the Britannicus. Jonathan, what is wrong with you? I don't think I know what's wrong with them. We just had a super stressful day. It's kind of fun. This girl got smacked in the head today at the roller rink. Smacked? Anyway, she, she looks like she's gonna be fine. She's totally fine. <laughs> she didn't look fine. Yeah. <laughs> Help! What do you do? What do you do? Do you just stand there and wait? Oh, good. Well, well, look who's decided to join. What are you guys doing? Gearing up, training for the hunts. Relax. And we're not killers like hey. Now we just want to talk to him. Get him to admit his crime. Yeah, a little friendly neighborhood chat. If you're not up for this, you can go home. There's no judgment. Go home. Go. You'll still be one of us, alright? Go home. Okay. Where's his jacket? I want to help. We tapped into the Hawkins PD dispatch with our Cerebro, and they're definitely looking for you. And the good news? 
Her name hasn't gone public yet. But if we find out about you, it's only a matter of time before others do too. And once that gets out, everyone and their shallow-minded mother is going to be gunning for you. I know everything that's been saying sounds totally delusional, but we've actually been through this kind of thing before. I mean, they have a, a few times, and, and I have once. Yeah, see, we usually rely on this girl with superpowers, but uh, those went bye-bye, so... Uh, so we're technically in, in, in more of the uh, brainstorming phase. Brainstorm. There's nothing to worry about. See anyone lurking about? You know, someone who looks like they shouldn't be there. No. No, no, there, there was nobody there. And I already told this to Officer Daniels. Miss Weaver. It was by the picnic table, is that correct? She's like, oh, shit. So, um, are we just not going to talk about it? About what? Yeah, I guess, um, I guess I'm just a little, uh, I guess I just don't really understand. Why didn't you tell me what's going on here? You've seen it. I've been bullied my entire life. I mean, I, I know what it's like. No, you don't. I am different. I do not belong. Everyone looks at me like... like I'm a monster. Well, they just don't know you. The way you looked at me. You, you were scared of me. No, And she went no. psycho for a second. That's not, that's, that's not true. I was surprised. It doesn't change anything. It doesn't matter. I, I care for you... so much. Care. But you don't, you don't love me anymore. Who, who said that I didn't? You never say it. From my, from my, from my, from my, from my, from my, okay, 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 I love you, you're being ridiculous. What, like, what is this? You can't let these mouth breathers ruin you, ruin us. I mean, they're nobodies. You're a superhero. Does that love you? Not anymore. Hi, is uh, Jane Hopper live here? Uh, yeah, um, what is this about? You may or may not be aware of an incident that happened last night involving Jane. Right there. Did you ask? That was an accident. We have a warrant here that says otherwise. A warrant? Can they take her? Without her parents? Yeah. Yeah. They can't enter the home without... They have a warrant. Exactly an expert in parenting, <laughs> but for what little is worth, I think he did the right thing. Is it always cold there? Like, damn, it's fresh, huh? They have, they have there. Now I got a machine for this. I'm just thinking that. Absolutely. Fred started acting weird the second we got here. Acting weird as in... scared? Max and Chrissy was upset too. Yeah, but not here. She was crying in the bathroom at school. If you saw a monster, you, you wouldn't go to the police. They never believe you. But you might go to your shrink. Oh, whoa, Max. Max! Max, where are you going? Uh, this is something I want to check on first. Something that maybe you want to share with the rest of us? Okay, this is... Stupid. Us ladies will stick together. Unless you think we need you to protect us. He just won't be with Nancy. You try to get that old thing back. Max 
still lives over there, so. Mm. Mm, especially not after that. Can't know people? They know my sister. We're just trying to find Eddie, man. Well, you have eyes now, Jenny's not here. Let's go. No, no. Hey, man. Ah, what? Benson Henderson. What? Benson Henderson. Hey, he was, he was falling around looking for Eddie, and he found him. He found him. See? It wasn't so hard, was it? And that's when you struck her. Don't admit to I'm shit. Where's her lawyer? And why did you hit her? Has she hit me? She assaults me with milkshake. No. You don't know. She had a grade two concussion. Did she okay. know that? And? No. Okay. 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 Yes, she got sick. It looks like she's still being processed. Okay, because they're putting her in the system, after which point she'll be transferred to jail. Uh, what? The military's about to find her. A detention hall. They didn't even give her a lawyer. Yes. No woman or her brothers and her family. That's not enough. You have to be a parent or legal guardian. You have to be kidding. That's ridiculous. That's the law. But I'm saying, when she had, had it's to, it's to like, bullshit. I mean, she wasn't even trying to help. Then what do we do? I mean, you can visit her until you love her. He can redeem his letters. You know where um, she lives? Yeah, of course. It's a small course. town. And you off duty and you... They know where the uh, teacher from the first season lives. Okay. Like. We gonna talk about... Hmm? Uh, sorry, talk about what? Your temporary insanity earlier today when you basically threw yourself at Nance. Are you implying that I still have a thing for Nance? No, I'm not implying. I'm You're... stating, and as it relates to your steadfast refusal to date Robin, it's pretty much the only logical explanation. That's not the only one. Well, it's just, with everything that's happening, with all the murders, it's, it's making everything worse again. And when you keep your feelings, your pain, bottled up the way you do, it doesn't take much to trigger them again. Do you think you're ready to talk more about that night? Chrissy was murdered. Cops asked me a bunch of questions. Did they talk to you? I mean, I know you were seeing Chrissy. Max, you know I can't talk about Chrissy or any other student. You wouldn't want me talking to any other students about you, right? If I were dead and would talk about the killer, then yeah, I most definitely would. Can I use the bathroom? Should sure. I look at friends? Up the stairs to the left. Thanks. 
because she don't really got friends like that. I mean, she do, but she don't, you know? Those are her keys. Oh, her office keys that she just has labeled. I have no other sign. You know what? We keep looking. Not that big. Dustin. Only so many places these freaks can burrow. <laughs> Are you guys looking for Eddie? Yeah, we found him. No thanks to you. You found him? He's at a boathouse. Okay? No, don't tell him. Don't worry, he's safe. You guys only killed Chrissy, right? That's bullshit. Lucas, you're so bad, it's ridiculous. Okay, just meet us at the school. We'll explain later. Oh shit. What the hell were you doing? I used to be friends. I was, I was looking for clues. Clues? Here, let's go. He don't tell me. I found one. Bro, you still not just living your trauma? Ah, oh, shit, here come the feds. A juvie in the desert? Y'all couldn't just take her to a juvie somewhere close by? Oh. She looked like. Are you transporting a Jane Hopper? Yeah, I'll do this. I'll take her off your hands. Whatever happened with the demodog thing? Hey, guys. Oh, way. We got Tylenol up in there. Anything juicy over there? Nothing new. <laughs> yep. Same here. Any mention of dark wizards or alternate dimensions? Things in that vein? I don't know. Big waste of time. And you're obviously bored, so why don't you just call Steve? You do know that Steve and I are, like, totally not a thing, right? What? I should be an Holy asshole. Shit. The Weekly Watcher, I can't believe they have this. Don't they write about, like, Bigfoot and UFOs? May I remind you that we are looking for information on dark wizards? If someone's gonna write about that, it's gonna be these weirdos. Victor Creel claims vengeful demon killed family. The murder that shocked a small community. Ah, that's very funny. I'm not kidding. According to several insiders, Victor believed his house was haunted by an ancient demon. So Victor claimed his exorcism failed, but it angered this demon, which then murdered mm. his family and removed him from eyes. Victor was declared legally insane by the court, right? Well, what if this is why? What if a demon did invade Victor's home? It's just, this demon wasn't any old demon. What's that now? So Nancy's a genius. That was first victim date back all the way to 1959. Her shot in the dark was a bullseye. Okay, that's... Uh, Wait, what are you doing? Correcting the entering in a school or tracing confidential and extremely personal files. First maps. You're up here. Lady names. The states are ass over here. Stop. Holy shit. Found it? Yeah, I can write just Chrissy's file. This don't feel like a, a talking kind of situation. We kind of beat his friends. Why don't you just call the police? He wants justice. Sorry about all the theatrics out there. I, I, I didn't mean to scare you, but uh, you, you got yourself into quite a little predicament, didn't you? Because I thought, you know, safe town, small, dull, far from Hawkins, nothing could happen here. Am I in trouble? For the roller skating? No, no, no. I don't know how to say this other than just to say it. Hawkins is in danger. You have fought this evil before and you've won. But this evil is like a virus. Each time it returns, it comes back stronger. A war is coming to Hawkins. Are you ass Frank? We're good people. Brave friends who have helped you fight your battle in the past. I know it's not fair to ask more of you, but I wouldn't be here if I didn't think this was the only way. But I don't have powers. I don't have my powers. 
powers. What if I told you there was a way? I feared this moment would come, so I've been preparing, developing the means to restore your abilities. I believe you'll have a cure. And that's why if we're really gonna do this, I'm gonna ask that you leave with me now. You no, know, there is a very real possibility this program fails. And if it does, you will never see your friends again. I'm afraid your friends and Hawkins are very much. Can I see friends now? In the eye of the storm. You don't hear shit. If you heard it, no, you didn't. She heard it. She I don't hear, hear shit. Y'all wanna go get some 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 hot dogs, pizza. Wasn't he after old the other kid? Run it back, Max. Run it back. sense for the story but <clears throat> that, would, that would be crazy if they did that uh, that was our reaction to Stranger Things season 4 chapter 3 thank you to our 13,241 subscribers at, at the, the time, time of this recording. recording thank you to Electric and Shannon Jefferson thank you to our patron film productions 816 we appreciate you for being patron thank you film productions 816 Ooh. Video's over.